Hello everyone, I just want to give you a quick warning that some of the language in this video is quite strong and that might be offensive. I hope you enjoy this video, let's begin. Alright, so welcome back to today's video and uh, it's going to be a bit of a change today's video. I mean, it's going to be about lighting, but it's also going to be about people that disagree with what I do. So we'll be reading some hate comments, but also uh, there's been a post going around recently on the Facebook group UK Touring Crew and uh, basically it's this is not going to be me saying oh you know like me um, saying stuff you know bad stuff to them it's just going to be kind of answering questions and the hate comments is just kind of a laugh as well so we'll see what happens with that um, but I also want to kind of do more podcasts as well like don't get me wrong I'll still do vlogs but I'm kind of enjoying doing podcasts as well, like I've not done for quite a while and it's just cool just kind of chilling and talking to you guys. Uh, so basically we're going to read the hate comments first and then we're going to go to the Facebook post. So thankfully there's not that many hate comments as well. Someone just put no. Yes. I don't see the arad. You're too young to be in the industry for 10 years, you're barely 9. Well, if you don't see the award, if that's what you're trying to say, then you know, you might want to have a look at the picture you clicked which is called a thumbnail and yes i have actually been in the industry for 10 years and yes i did start at five i'll tell you why so my dad was in a band and my dad played in a club called rio's it wasn't really a club it was a venue rio's was in bradford and uh he asked the lighting designer to look after me which he did and uh i had a little go to the lights and then he was like do you want to do your dad's band and i was like yeah and i absolutely loved it and i was hooked on it since and i've just i just love lighting just can't get enough of it Go to the next comment. Fuck off. I don't really know where to go, so. Got me to hear mum some more. I don't know how to read that, so we're gonna Google Translate it. Fuck your mum, fell dead bastard. Quite nice. Um. Thank you. My God, your voice is so fucking annoying. Why are you watching the video? Then like, cut your hair, which has got three likes. Okay, I might do actually. Give it a go. I'm gonna cut my hair. Literally. You ready? Three, two, one. I hope he subscribes to my YouTube channel now for me cutting my hair. Cause that was some that was some skill that I, I've got to say. Like that was some skill. So I hope he subscribes. Award winning LDs don't use Ava likes. I know a few. Tom Campbell, uh, Jim Thompson. Uh, and a few more. I think that might be the final comment, which is pretty cool. Right, we're gonna read this post now, so I'm not gonna mention any names. Um, just, you know, even though it's negative, I'm not gonna mention any names. I'm not gonna show any names. Just for protection and also to care, basically, because I am a caring person, kind of. Right, so we're gonna read it. This was posted on the UK Touring Crew Facebook page. Just thought I'd bring something that is slightly concerning to me, to people's attention. I am aware of a so-called company called Spiral Stage Lighting, which is run by a 14 to 15 year old child. They describe themselves as a company and use terms like managing director uh, to s describe the person orchestrating it. So basically, Spiral Stage Lighting is not a company. If you have heard me say company, it was a mistake. I have, it's always been a service. I might have accidentally said company when I'm talking fast but spiral stage lighting is a service I do have someone called Mike Green who helps me with all the insurance and all the laws and stuff like that he has studied in university and has passed many degrees uh, with business and uh, politics and he has also you know on previous businesses so he doesn't know what he's doing with this type of stuff this 14 year old oh by the way I'm not 14 I'm 15 going on 16 I'm 16 in September Yay. This 14 year old at the time of upload has posted various videos on YouTube with titles such as 8 ways to become an award winning lighting designer and the fakes. I find it slightly astonishing that I am being told by a child how to become a better LD. Well first off, why are you watching the video? Why are you watching the video? You saw me in the thumbnail, why did you click it? Why are you watching the video? That video, a lot of people have come to me and said things about it, but it's not, me I'm not the best lighting designer in the world. I made that video to show, you know, like to say about my experience and what I've done. You don't necessarily need to do it, it's just what I've done. It's like people do, you know, the YouTube videos about, oh, how I got to 100,000 subscribers. I'm talking about this. It's not necessarily me saying I'm the best lighting designer in the world. Watch this videos. I'm all for encouraging new talent in the industry. <laughs> 
definitely is. And supporting people who are learning the trade, however, I do find it concerning that he's being presented as a professional company which is not registered and I doubt will have the correct insurance to work on your event with them being a minor. I do have full insurance, I have full public liability, I have full insurance, everything like that. Again, Mike Green is helping me with that. I do have public liability certificate. What do people think about all of this? Before I come in, please do a little bit of research to support your view and opinions, as there are a lot of things about this that cannot be explained on you unless you see what I am, and I guess that's what says what I'm talking about, but it's kind of being blocked off. But I understand what this guy's coming from, at least he's not calling me, uh, you know, at least he's not calling me any uh, harsh names, but like, at the end of the day, I am not breaking the law, everything is fine, and if you have a problem with me, then please leave this channel. Do you want, a, do you want an award? Do you want a medal? Do you want to meet the queen? Like, I, I can't help you with that, I'm afraid. But all I'm doing is I'm literally doing my hobby. I like doing, like, I love doing lighting, it is my hobby, and my service, Spiral Stage Lighting, is fully insured, I'm fully insured, everything is fine. I have Mike Green, who is helping me with all the insurance, and all the, uh, the, kind of the, the... What do you call it? The the business side of things. Even though Spiral Stage Lighting is not a business, it is a service. Also, uh, like like I said, don't let people put you down like this. Just keep going, and you know you don't need this type of people. You just, that's the point. Like this guy who posted on the on the uh, Facebook page, he was looking for opinions. At the end of the day, who was not saying any mean stuff. He was genuinely being professional. So I do, you know, I I, I do personally. You know, I'm not angry at this guy, he's just literally posting on the group, he's not saying any mean things to me, but yeah. I'm planning also, as well, hopefully to go to Plaza London, if you are there, please come and say hello, it'd be awesome. Yeah, feel free to come and say hi, um, I'm just gonna be walking about, literally, like, saying hello to, uh, uh Lights and Roby and all that. But I hope you enjoyed this video, please leave a like, again, if you have any questions, please comment it down below this video, please subscribe, turn on, turn notifications on, and please share, it would mean quite a lot, and, uh, I hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you later. Thanks for watching. Three, two, one. I hope he subscribes to my YouTube channel now for me cutting my hair, because that was some that was some skill that I, I've got to say. Like that was some skill.